sometimes it's hard to find locations in space uh, without doing first some sketch lines and that means we're going to have to delete those sketch lines after we're done with them which means we're going to waste some time on doing that but there is some way to avoid doing those sketch line works now in this lesson we're going to recreate some of these circles we see here uh, in this shape here using those methods going to zoom a little and pan a little here and I'm going to launch my, my line command now we don't exactly know where the center of this circle is but we know that uh, the center of the circle is 2.75 units uh, from this point to the right and 3.83 units to down here and we're going to find that center point uh, by using uh, by doing some sketch lines I'm going to click on this point and I'm going to turn my ortho on I'm going to type 2.75 and enter come down and 3.83 enter and escape and now this is the center point of the circle we want to create here but this means we're going to have to delete these two lines uh, this line we created here which is going to take some time but I'm going to delete this line and I'm going to uh, launch my circle command and uh, here I'm going to type TK and now TK stands for temporary tracking point temporary tracking point means that AutoCAD is going to do those sketch lines that we did AutoCAD is going to do that and it's going to delete those sketch lines for us this way we're going to save some time on our works I'm going to press enter and see how that works and I'm going to pick a point right here at this point and come to the right and enter 2.75 which we see here 2.75 enter and come down and enter 3.83 enter now this is our center point and we're going to have to uh, enter to accept this point and we're going to enter the radius which is 0.40 as we see here 0.4 enter and this is uh, our circle we created without uh, using any sketch lines now let's create this other circle here and we're going to talk about the, uh, that a little more I'm going to launch my circle command and this circle has a radius of 1.40 units and the center of it is uh, the center of the circle we already have created it I'm going to click and that and type 1.4 enter very easily I'm going to snap a little down here we're going to have to recreate these two circles here now I'm going to launch my circle command again and as you see the center of this circle is one uh, is 6.50 unit from the center of the circle down and we don't know where that is exactly but we're going to find it I've launched my circle command and I'm going to type TK and enter now take a look at the point when I click look there's a line here this line is the same uh, sketch line that we were creating before but after we define our desired point and we click enter and we press enter it's going to be uh, deleted it disappears now I'm going to type 6.5 and enter this is a point as you saw that uh, line uh, 
has disappeared and another line has been created for us now as we enter that line disappears as well and I'm going to type the radius of that circle which is 0.8 enter we're going to launch uh, by pressing the spacebar launch the circle command I'm going to recreate the other circle which has a radius of 3 and enter by using the temporary tracking point we can save a lot of time by not creating some sketch lines and deleting them.